Hello everyone, my name is Fred Heyman and I'm with the law firm of Heyman Hogue. We are a faith-based estate planning and elder law firm in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Today I'm going to talk to you about what the difference is between a will and a trust. We get this question all the time. Should I have a will or should I have a trust? The biggest difference between the will and a trust is how it's treated at the time of death and what benefits it gives you during life. So a will is something that everybody needs at the very, very minimum. If you don't have a will, you do have a will, the government wrote it for you and you don't want their will. So at minimum, you wanna write a will that says what you want done at the time of death. Now the problem with a will though, is that a will most of the time has to be probated. Probate is a legal process whereby you have to hire an attorney, you have to file the will into court, you have to wait on the judge and then talk to the judge once the judge has time to see you. And the judge has to approve the will, accept the will, and give authority to carry out the, the, the terms of the will. All of that can be a long, lengthy process. A trust does two things that my clients have never, ever complained about. It keeps the government out of your life and it keeps the courts out of your life. And everything that's done through a trust is done outside of court jurisdiction. So a trust gives you lifetime benefits. So for instance, if a trust is properly written, it has language in it that can avoid uh, guardianship. So if you become incapacitated during life, your trust can have language in it that allows family members to take care of you and to take care of your finances without having to go to court and get legal guardianship. And then upon passing, it avoids probate because a trust is like a treasure chest. It holds your treasure and that treasure chest never gets sick and it never dies. So sickness and death is not affected by the transfer of property out of a trust. So the reality is, is a will is good, but a trust is great. And it's a great thing for everybody, not just the wealthy, not just people with lots of assets. I have people with very few assets that will choose doing a trust because it makes life so much easier on their family. It privatizes your life. It keeps the government and courts out of your life and it allows you to avoid family fights because you're not opening the courtroom doors to the courthouse like you do with a will. So I hope this has answered some questions on what the difference between a will and a trust is, but I'm sure you have a lot more. So if you would like to call us, if there's any way Heyman Hogue can help you in any way answering any of your personal questions, we'd be more than happy to do that. Just give us a call at the, call you'll, the, at the number you'll see on the screen. Thank you so much for listening to me today. God bless.